tonight also with the championship season finally at end um let's take a look at how wrong i was when it came to our predictions now um last season well the season before sorry when i take a look at our predictions i was pretty wrong uh things didn't necessarily go correctly for me um but that's not to say that i didn't get things right i also did get some things right so what i'm gonna do real quick is because i should have probably set this up earlier but i'm a retard so i didn't so what's going to happen is I am going to set up a tab that's going to show me the final table and then I've got a tab open that shows me, you know, the um, the predicted table. So, first things first, this was the final table. Of course, Leicester as champions, we all expected that. Uh, and this was where the rest of us finished. Now, let's take a look at where I said everyone would finish. So I said Leicester would be champions. It's an instant W, so that's 1 out of 24 straight away. Now, second place, I said Southampton. It was Ipswich. Now, I was miles off with Ipswich. I, um, you know, when the season began uh, and I heard other people say that they're going to finish really high up the table, I was like, don't talk, wait, they've just come up. They're not, they're good, but they're not that good. No, they really are that good. So, congratulations to Ipswich. You've absolutely smashed it. You know, you almost became champions of the league, which is insane to say the least, but, you know, fair play. Southampton actually finished in the playoffs at fourth. Now, at third place, I said it would be Coventry, and that was wrong. At one point, they were in the playoffs, but um, they kind of just bottled it and fell out, and, you know, Leeds ended up third instead. I knew Leeds would end up in the playoffs, but I didn't think they'd end up third. I thought they'd, you know, bottle it a wee bit, but yeah. Fourth place, I said Middlesbrough. In actuality, it was Southampton. Fifth place, I said it would be Leeds, and it was West Brom. And sixth place, I said Sunderland best on the season they had previously. And it ended up being Norwich, but Sunderland came into this season for whatever reason, nowhere near the side they were last time, and it didn't go their way whatsoever. Middlesbrough actually finished 8th, and Sunderland actually finished 16th. Coventry actually finished 9th. So I said for 7th place would be Stoke. I don't know why. Uh, I'm gonna, If I was to assume why I picked Stoke to be 7th is based on the transfer window they had signing a lot of players and whatnot. Uh, no, Stoke actually had a nightmare of a season and finished 17th. Uh, they did rescue their season. At one point, they were at risk of relegation, but they rescued their season pretty quickly. Um, I said Millwall at 8th, which they also had a stinky season and finished 13th. Blackburn at 9th, which they had a very stinky season and could have been relegated on the last day. At 10th place, I had Norwich, who actually finished in the playoffs. At 11th, I had Albion, who finished in the playoffs. And at 12th, I had... <laughs> what the fuck? Passing on your sneezes. Um, at 12th, I had us, which, to my surprise, we didn't finish 12th for a change. We finished 10th. We improved by two places. Um, of course, the R end of the season was fucking tragic, but um, at least we didn't finish 12th. We finished just above mid-table in the top 10, so it weren't awful, but it was still shit. Um, at 13th, I had Swansea, and Swansea actually finished 14th, so I was pretty close with that one, I guess. Um... 14th, I had Ipswich. We already know that was wrong. Same with Hull at 15th. That were dead wrong there. We only just missed playoffs. I had Watford at 16th. Uh, if I said Hull at 16th, I promise that was not my fault. Just my shilly bad maths. Uh, so that was Hull at 16th. Uh, not Hull. Uh, Watford at 16th. We actually finished 15th. So that was pretty close. I had Birmingham at 17th, which was wrong. They got relegated. Um, I had Bristol at 18th, which they finished mid-table at 11th. Uh, I had Argyle at uh, what's that, 17, 18, 19th, and Argyle finished 21st, avoid just narrowly avoiding relegation. So, okay. I had Chef Wednesday here at 20th, and they finished 20th. There we go. So that's uh, <laughs> two out of 24. Oh no, um, this isn't looking good. 21st, I had QPR, which at one point they were on track to finish there, but of course they uh, they also had a good spell at the end of the season. And relegation, I got um, Huddersfield. Cardiff and Rotherham, two of which were correct, but not in the right places. Rotherham at 24th was correct, we all expected that, but Huddersfield I had at 22nd, not 23rd, so I did get one of the relegation candidates correct, but not in the correct place, so I got a grand total of 3 out of 24. Now, is that an improvement from last year? Shut up, you silly sausage. Is that an improvement from, why does it keep playing the same video? Right, I need to see Jesus, is that an improvement over last time. Let's take a look. How wrong was I last time? Um, I'm going to need to scroll and find this out. Actually, did I say how wrong I was last time? Let's find out, shall we?
Okay, so the only one I got right last time was Blackpool finishing 23rd. Uh, I, had, I actually had Birmingham for relegation last time, which is interesting. Um, but yeah, that's interesting to say that I only got one right last time. So we've improved by two points, just like Preston. <laughs> um, we fish for positives on this channel, being a Preston supporter. But yeah, um, that's that. There were my championship predictions and how wrong I actually was. How wrong were you guys? Let me know. Um, so, uh, if you're not already aware, this was one of my... This will be one of, like, three or four final videos that I make on this channel. Um, so, yeah. Um, I will make a video giving my predictions for the 23-24... No, sorry, the 24-25 season. Uh, when we find out who our opponents in the league will actually be. I won't be re uh, reacting to how wrong I was, in, you know, when the season's finished. But, um, yeah, well, you, you'll probably see that on Twitter. Follow. Um, thanks for watching. Um, bye.